It is Friday. You know what time it is. It's time for SoCal Spotlight, where we highlight a different community each Friday, take you in depth, show you all that's going on there. Today, we're going to head to Riverside. It's about 60 miles east of Los Angeles, and that's where we find our Sheba Turk this morning, uh, about to show off what makes this Inland Empire community just so special, Sheba. Hi, Jamie. Yes, it is so nice to hear people love where they live, and that is the case for folks in Riverside. So we're starting off in one of the gems of Riverside, the historic Mission Inn, which is just gorgeous. A lot of people say it feels like you're inside of a European castle. We'll be showing you around there this morning, but first, we want you to hear why people love Riverside so much. I absolutely love Riverside. People who live in Riverside say there's a lot to fall in love with here. Uh, you can be in the middle of downtown in one minute. The next, you could be up in the hills. Uh, you could be in the orchards in another. There's diversity in the landscapes and in the food. I think you can go on one corner and eat a little bit of everything. You can eat either Vietnamese, Thai, Chinese, Mexican, Lebanese food all on one corner. I mean, Riverside really has that. The other thing that we really enjoy out here is just the arts. Mayor Patricia Locke Dawson says that when her residents praise Riverside, they aren't exaggerating. I know every city tells you this, but Riverside's a very special place. Riverside is actually a very large city with a population just over 300,000. We are unique um, in that we are known as a big city with a small town feel. We're larger than 99% of all the cities in the United States. And the population is relatively young. The average age for residents is 32. Riverside is the number one destination in the country for young people to move to right now because of its affordability, because of the opportunities we have here. The city has four colleges and universities, and Riverside is also home to the world-famous Mission Inn. The Block Long Hotel has hosted presidents and celebrities and was the setting for some big movies like The Man in the Iron Mask back in the 90s. Uh, we also have a uh, Citrus State Historic Park. Riverside is also the birthplace of the California citrus industry, and it has plenty of great options for art lovers, including the Cheech, a museum with art showcasing comedian Cheech Marin's collection of Chicano art, which is believed to be the largest collection of its kind in the world. It's our ethos in Riverside to value art and history and culture. So the Mission Inn is very special to this area, but it's also a national historic landmark. There's so much history here, and the detail around the architecture and the design here is absolutely beautiful. We'll be showing you that this morning and telling you the history of the Mission Inn, which dates all the way back, Jamie, to the 1800s. That's amazing. I Think love about it. that. And she looks so cozy there <laughs> on this rainy day. I know Sheba. we got to get you a right? fire in that I'm fireplace. Just yeah. myself at home. <laughs>